Hello guys. In this video, I will tell you whether you should pull Wakiris. Hi, hello, I'm Henry. This is a video for foreigners. Hola, este video tiene subtítulos en español. Hola, este video tem legendas en portugués. Eh, 안녕하세요. 이번에도 한 글자막이 있습니다. Всем привет. Это видео с русскими субтитрами. Bonjour. Cet video a des sous-titres en français. Hello, this video has Deutsche Untertitel. 大家好,这次有中文字幕. This is the tier list including the coming banners in October. I think Treasure Hunter Melissa is still the best, so I made a new tier. Swimsuit Aqua, Cielo, Erica and Chris are obviously better than others, so I put them in SS. Okay, first. Don't pull hot spring banner. Now let's talk about Wakirisu. Skill 1 deals 171% fire damage and minor heals to all allies. Skill 2 deals 199%. If her HP is more than 70%, then the damage increases to 273. She's very powerful now because she is the first physical attacker with two single attack skills. You can almost use her in every arena as back one, if you use Megumi in front. Halloween Union has one single attack and one AoE attack. She has a minor agility buff for 12 seconds. It's a very good skill. Poison is almost useless in this game. But shall we pull Halloween banner or not? She's very good now. But what if Lightning Iris and Earth Iris come after this? They also have two single attack skills. They are equally good. And what about Christmas? What about the second super? I told you that when second super comes in the future, mages will become more powerful than physical attackers. We will have to use mages in all arenas. My guess is that Wakirisu will be very powerful for at least two months. And she will still be good sub because of her physical attack passive. What about Yunyun? She is a mage. Yes. She's still on top of fire arenas in Japanese version, but it's actually more important to have Christmas Wiz in fire arenas. Another point is that in Japanese version's Halloween banner, they actually have rate up together with new Halloween units in 2021. Many people pulled Wakiris last year, so we actually hate to see them in Japanese version's gacha. So who should pull Wakiris? If you don't mind paying in game, don't hesitate to pull her, because she's very powerful. If you are free to play, but you are lucky enough in gacha, I also suggest you get them. Alright, see you next time.